We're we learning the lesson. Off about it, yeah. I'm, I'm not dropping your your names. I'm not right. well, actually, can I say something? Oh, so you dropped something. We've there, met me. a few people oh, ourselves. Yeah, what's you know what I mean? Like? I will say something about Riz. I want to say something. This is the most aggressive kind of love I've ever had from you. What are you doing? You're really in my space. Jesus. <laughs> None. We're having, in Hollywood we, now. We might not be from it. Right. I do want to say Riz. Stop with the pointing right now. This is my This is the second movie I made with Riz. This is not here from London. We do know what goes on here. Okay. Just building up your old press release. No, I'm just saying. <laughs> Jets, good to see you too. You too. You too. I'm a professional. I've been doing this for a quarter of a century, going all over the world to talk to people, but I still kind of fanboy out a little bit about this movie. It's that good. Oh, do good. you two fanboy out? Like, do you get on set and go, oh, I loved you in the Batman movie? And you say, I loved you in Rogue One, or none of that? No. No, never. No, 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 we're British. <laughs> that's what I think. We barely make eye contact, to be honest, yeah. It inside, we do that possibly, but it's it's, yeah. it's, it's, it's in silence, that transaction. Yeah, maybe. yeah, we mainly deal with passive aggression. That's how yeah. we show affection <laughs> in, in the that, UK. That's so <laughs> true. Morning, Tom. Hey. Morning, Riz. Not even. And that would be it. I mean, that's on a good so day. Well. <laughs> that's on a good day, you know. When you think about it, if you're meant to do characters, you probably should stay as far apart on set because you're supposed to have a little bit of... I don't know. I go back and forth on that. I mean, I think sometimes you can't force that, I think, necessarily, but I think sometimes the characters and the relationships that you've got in a film, that ends up replicating on set. No, that's sometimes not, yeah, it does. It's not nice that, no, I said sometimes it does, but I says I don't think you should try and ever force that. Right. And actually, I think it replicates for me, not so much when you're like got an antagonistic relationship with someone but more when you've got a close relationship with someone in a mm -hmm. film or a story then i feel like that can start kind of you know replicating offset or i don't know like when i did the night of you know john john totoro's character sure. kind of takes me under his wing and that's what it kind of became like on the on the on the set as well you know or I don't know if you've done some buddy movies and you'll become like best mates for it. Right, right. But um, but yeah, I don't really push that envelope too hard of like, oh, I've got to hate this person, so we're going to like... You limit your options. Yeah. The, your, the, you, you harvest the greater an abundance of options. The, the, more, the, more, the more pleasure the more you love can have, you lay, the more love you, you know? lay down. I mean, the, the, bigger, the better the team, for me, I think, is the more you can trust in your oppo. So it's like, you know, like, what do you want to do? And let's make that happen and manifest, you know what I mean? So it, it, I think the more team we find and the more times I work with people over and over again, it's a further engagement. It's true, it closes you off, isn't it? Yeah, antagonism just, is like tension. It's like closes you off, whereas like embracing stuff is like open. And, and, and you, you can right. still reflect the antagonism in your work by being open because you can choose on your smorgasbord between the two partners yeah, yeah, yeah. of like where you want to play and how you want to play. You limit so much and you've already dictated and decided what you're going to do. You turn up and say... I don't like this person. It's like mm. you're really playing one note and actually aren't part of a team. I, I find that deeply self-centered and narcissistic. Sorry. Your director's <laughs> leaning on you to bring some comedic moments that we haven't exactly seen you do before. You mean I'm not funny? I think you're extremely funny. I just <laughs> haven't seen it on camera okay. often. Well, well, thanks for like that, bud. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> That's it. All right. Oh, we laughed. Well, you know, you laid it out there, so I'll go ahead and say this. You're not I, funny. Uh, <laughs> you are very funny. <laughs> Thank but you. Just know when you're trying to be. All right, bud. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen you in movies be funny. Oh, thanks. Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, no, I mean your no, characters no. aren't funny. That's okay, buddy. That's cool. Right? <laughs> Each to their this own. is like the opposite of that Joe Pesci Goodfellas scene. Uh, um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're not funny. You mean I'm not here to amuse you? Yeah. <laughs> it's bizarre. It's, I've interviewed, you know, like I said, I've interviewed pretty much every A-list actor, every Academy Award winner. Don't have to the show last... off about it, man. Yeah. I'm, I'm not dropping your box, names. Man. That's Back in your box. Well, so you drop I'm, something we've there, met baby. a few people oh, yeah, ourselves. What's, what's you know what I mean? Like? Oh, yeah. There is a point, Calm bloody down. rodeo geese. Jesus. None We're heaven. in Hollywood we, now, We may not be from here. We're not here from London. We do know what goes on here. Okay, just building up your old press release. No, I'm just saying that in all of that, only two intimidate me as much is you who Tommy Lee Jones is the other guy and you I always like I'm I wet my pants walking in the room for fear of talking to you you well, you're sitting on your phone, bro, so be careful. <laughs> you want electric kids? It's, 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 it's water, 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 water resistant. Let me look at that. Do we got a right. towel? Dude? Yeah, that's you know, that's, don't anyway. make your <laughs> problems my problems. Okay. So you're you're amongst friends here. Okay, yeah, it's right. and I can, uh, I'm funny. Have sometimes. you seen the movie yet? Yeah, I know that he's funny. And yeah, and then work. we can move past it. We're past it. You're funny. 
<laughs> You're funny. Thank you. Have you Thank seen you. the finished product yet? No. No. Okay. You're going to love it. I, I want to see it. We have, we have, we have seen it. We have seen it. Yeah, Michelle good. Williams hadn't seen it. She oh, had really? questions for me. Is she funny? She's funny when she needs to be. Okay. <laughs> He's very diplomatic about this. Yeah, now. that needs exactly. to be a bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, telling. suddenly now I get the big this. <laughs> Guys. Oh, now, and now you're just leaving. Good okay, brilliant. It. Thanks for that. Thanks. 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 My apologies. <laughs> I, so what's happening, I demanded a three-camera shoot, so Jake's getting another angle for me. It's a good to, to angle. push in on that, would I you? I gotta say, profile on Riz is a good angle. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Appreciate that. Absolutely. I'll get this in the pocket one day. I've interviewed, this is like the fifth time I've interviewed you at TIFF alone, I know. Jake. Yeah, and I know. I'd always thought you to be a nice guy, but just moments ago I witnessed cliche Hollywood demands. What? what He's for, getting uh, an oat milk beverage. First of all, oat milk. Well, actually, can I say something? That's actually a very socially conscious demand because the creation of almond milk is something that really drains water resources, particularly when we're in a kind of global warming situation. And California Boom. in particular... You know, it's very dry climate. Yeah. We should all think about also. We should think about coffee to, too. We to really should. Milk. You know what I mean? Because uh, tea is probably yeah. a better and alternative. I just want you so I'm actually being to sustainable. Think about... Can I just? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's funny? In the middle of all this, we just got one of the most profound messages I think I've ever gotten in one of these. Yeah. Rooms. So don't underestimate so actors. I'm just giving him some profound you know what I mean? Right because now. actors <laughs> and, really uh, know what's up. You know what I mean? It's true. <laughs> I hope your oat milk beverage gets you. You can't even say it, which is the thing about it. I think it's really it's struggling. Time. You're hey, really this struggling. This is turning into a bullying situation. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to educate the brother. I only learned okay. oat milk like 15 seconds ago. Well, yeah, if man, I were drinking alone, regular dude. milk, man, I wouldn't be able to sit in this chair. So, you know, it's like, you know. Wow. Yeah. During the making of Sisters Brothers, is this what was going on after they said cut? No this is milk. what happens. No almond milk, no oat milk, uh, <laughs> no only way. dairy milk. Are you there kidding? Was only dairy milk uh, on the set. Yeah. Of Sisters Brothers, it presented a real uh, issue for the lactose intolerant <laughs> members of the cast yeah. and crew. How yeah. could you work like that? Um, we didn't. Have you seen the film? Uh, do some I'm not working very well. Not really okay. that well. <laughs> didn't, didn't work really out. Well. So when I see this film and there's a, you know this relentless honesty in the performances of the, the the tension sometimes between you two and the anguish you're going through. That's oat milk. That's, that's actually just cool. flatulence. That's, that's oat milk. Yeah. Okay. No, it's not flat. It's oat milk. Yeah, let's be honest. <laughs> it is low. I stuck some oat milk in there. All right, 10, 20 movies from now, when you look back to the making of this movie, what's the one scene, the making of that scene, that moment on the set that you're going to go back to? Full dairy performance. I would say, um, um, I, I, I think that my performance lactose <laughs> elements. The thing about well, my I performance, okay, yeah. uh, <laughs> I was trying to pun with lactose, lacked those. You know, oh, those right, right, right. Like, you cut me off and that now. Lactose, well, lactose. That lactose. of my genius. <laughs> no, they're not. They're not. They're not. Thanks, bro. I mean, yep. man. <laughs> If you so, haven't gotten it from this interview, this is a brilliant movie. Well done. You must go see it. And I love the two of you. Thanks for your time. I will say something about Riz. I want to say something. This is the him. most aggressive kind of love I've ever had from you. What are you doing? You're really in my space. I do want, I do want to I say, say Riz. Stop with the pointing right Riz is, now. Riz, he's, this is microaggression This is the second central. movie I made with Riz. Yeah. And I just want to say that. Um. <laughs> you know what I'm going to go get? Try it. Give it. An oat milk beverage. There it is. Yes. There you go. Oat milk beverage. Yeah. All right. Cheers, man. man. Appreciate Always a pleasure that. to see you. Thanks. Take guys. care. Thanks. See you in a bit. Hey, thank you so much for watching. Be sure and subscribe. Turn on your notifications and click right here to see more awesome videos. Do it right now. Popcorn for each time. More? Keep clicking. Good job.